That's right. The heroes of Wakanda will be showing off their new looks for this update. Mikey, which heroes can we look forward to this November? Shuri, Namor, Riri Williams, aka Ironheart, and a new hero, M'Baku. I can't wait to see what will unravel between the two geniuses, Shuri and Riri Williams. Not to mention, Namor has become even more commanding with the Tier 4 advancement. In addition, a special coupon code will be revealed at the end of the video. Please note, the footage presented in this video has been recorded with a test build, and there may be differences to the actual update. Without further ado, let's dive headfirst into the November update. Coming up first is the ruler of Tala Khan, Namor. He is brimming with the new powers gained from his Tier 4 advancement and also his new uniform. Namor will definitely be stealing the spotlight in this update. Yes, his edge on critical rate and damage will persist and will also freeze foes with deep sea cold damage. Now, his third skill will allow you to move while using the skill which will make him easier for our agents to control. His flowing action enables him to strike down on his enemies with his trident. He engages in battle as if he's swimming effortlessly across the ocean. Additionally, his passive skill and tier 2 passive skill have been enhanced to boost both his attack and his defense. We anticipate his performance as a dealer in world boss legend and alliance battle legend. The brain of Wakanda, Shuri, is sure to be a fan favorite for a lot of our agents. As many of our agents have already utilized her as support, many have been waiting for her tier 3 advancement. That's right, her tier 2 passive skill is a powerful skill of support. The effect that applies to all allies, basic damage dealt to supervillain faction, has been fortified, making her better support than ever before. On top of that, effects such as ignore dodge and increase skill damage have been buffed to boost her own capabilities, and her skill set has changed completely, so she can be played as a secondary dealer. Yes, she seems to be prepared to protect Wakanda as an heir to the throne. Next is Riri Williams, also known as Ironheart. She is ready to assist other dealers both as a leader and as support. Riri's new uniform and the potential transcendence of her trusted friend Moon Girl will be available with this new update. Did I just hear Moon Girl will be receiving potential transcendence? That's correct. But let's talk more about Riri for now. Riri's leader skill, which increases energy attack, will be enhanced. Also, her uniform effect increases ignore dodge and damage dealt to boss types, which applies to all allies. The looks are astounding. You can never get enough suits. Not to mention, she'll be able to move around while using the fourth skill. Powerful missiles and energy beams. That's quite impressive. Last but not least, M'Baku, leader of the Jabari clan, will be added as a brand new character. M'Baku, who fought for the throne of Wakanda against the Black Panther, has arrived in Marvel Future Fight. M'Baku possesses a leader skill that increases physical attack of all allies. Moreover, he has an increased damage dealt to supervillains and a decreased damage received from supervillains which will make him viable as support as well as leader. His third skill can be canceled so it can be used seamlessly with other skills. We expect him to make a mark as a member of Team Wakanda. Intriguing tells will be unfolding in Legendary Battle. Yes, a new Legendary Battle inspired by Marvel Studios' Black Panther Wakanda Forever has been added. Did you know that you can acquire heroes for free in Legendary Battle? Acquire M'Baku by enjoying Legendary Battle. Plus, there are also rewards for clearing Legendary Battle. Clear bonus missions in Extreme Mode to acquire various rewards such as a CTP. I really can't wait for this update to be live. And now, it's time for the coupon code. Please refer to the description below for more information.